So here's the lineup then for the semi finals Phoenix Girls of Brown against Lucrezia Millerini and Christine McGuinness against Chelsea Grimes. So, Chris Kamara, we're getting down to the serious stuff now. The semi finals, this first pairing Phoenix against Lucrezia. What do you think might unfold well, here? My money's on Phoenix. I think she is exceptional. So away they go. Phoenix was the most impressive of the climbers in the first round. Lucrezia was very unlucky, actually, not to post a, a very good time, but didn't quite touch the buzzer. Had two goes at it, both of them climbing really well here. But Phoenix is absolutely flying, and she's not far away from the buzzer already. Excellent from Phoenix Girls at Brown, 25-7-5. She really is upping her game now. We're getting to the pointy end of the competition. Lucrezia also climbing well, punching the thing for all she's worth, and still it didn't register, but she has to get a time for that. 35.18 for Lucrezia Millerini. So the second women's semi-final. Ding, ding, round two between these two. We saw them in the first round. Chelsea Grimes the winner. By some distance when they raced a little earlier in the first round. I'm not entirely sure, Cami, whether Christine will be delighted at being in the semi-finals or not. <laughs> well, she's going for it, Simon. Chelsea still executing that plan very confidently and methodically. This is impressive climbing. But Text Christine ball. climbing well too. And Chelsea 29.01. Textbook really good. And well done, Christine. Christine can see the touch board. It's very much within range now. She can almost reach out and touch it. 46-44. And now comes the hardest bit of the whole climb for Christine. Let it go, but she's getting the hang of it now. <laughs> Brilliant. Have faith, and she did. And um, we're looking at the happiest person inside Crystal Palace at the moment because she knows she's not going to have to go up there again. <laughs> Good win for Chelsea Grimes, though. You two through to that final, how are you both feeling? Tired, um, but happy, you know, I, I did not think I'd be even second in this. I thought I'd take fourth. So the fact that Lucrezia and Rebecca didn't record the time, that was mind blowing. I did not expect that at all. In practice, they've never fallen off. They've never slipped. Mm -mm. They've beaten us. Yeah. So it's just like anything can happen. I literally. suppose that's the thing at this stage. It's not just physical fatigue, it's mental fatigue. Yeah, exactly. Even then, you know, you, we're used to racing, racing, racing. And like I said, Rebecca's just, this This was her thing. I thought, you know, she's going to smash me <laughs> and I was just going to go well in. But the fact that you get up there, you're a bit, bit anxious. Yeah. You just do the wrong thing and that happens. So I'm absolutely buzzing in the final. Again. Come on then, come on! <laughs> Love this. Bring it on, Simon and Cammy. Let's look at those results and see who climbed to the top. Bring it on indeed. We've seen a little bit of history between those two earlier in the week, haven't we? Fighting for every point they possibly can. Phoenix Girls of Brown will race against Chelsea Grimes in the final of the women's speed climbing. Showtime, how are you feeling? I'm nervous as usual, but I'm gonna do my best and um, this one's gonna be fun just because it's the last day and it's just excitement and nerves and I don't know, it's gonna be fun. I really hope I don't mess up, man. Chelsea, tell me, are you gonna keep it clean? This this has been feisty between you two all week. We like it. Oh. It has, it has. To be honest, Phoenix technically is the better climber. So I'm gonna do reverse psychology. She should win this one. <laughs>